Welcome to the metropolis, the big city. This is where tech, trends, and culture meet. Meet the people. See the sights. Walk the city streets and experience the lifestyle. This is your first class ticket to the cities of the world. Hong Kong, situated in the eastern region of China's Pearl River, is Hong Kong. Its name roughly translates to fragrant harbor, as the city's natural geographic features make it an ideal water port. Hong Kong greatly embodies the Chinese concept of yin and yang, a balance of contrasting features. It's a modern city with a beautiful skyline. But at the same time, Hong Kong's roots are deeply rooted in rich Chinese and Buddhist cultures. Go urban and visit the cityscape for the biggest shopping malls and the best in modern architecture that the city has to offer, or take it slow by visiting the many age-old Buddhist and Confucian temples around Hong Kong. Because of its British colonial history, Hong Kong is also a veritable melting pot of East meets West cultures in Asia. You'll see that this is especially evident in the contrasting architectural marvels around the city. Hong Kong is considered as one of the international hubs in the region and is home to the biggest international companies operating in Asia. Hong Kong is also a food lover's paradise. Whether it's big fancy dining like Hong Kong's award-winning Tim Ho Wan, or just your hole-in-the-wall food stop, there's bound to be something for you. Of course, no visit is ever complete without some must-see destinations. If you're going to Hong Kong, don't forget to check out the Tan Tian Buddha, a giant 112-foot bronze statue depicting Buddha which is located in Hong Kong's Lantau Island. The Star Ferry Harbor Tour, a short 11-minute ferry across the Hong Kong Harbor. Tickets are cheap and the ferry schedule is set throughout the day. It's a great way to catch a glimpse of the Hong Kong skyline. For those eager for the Hong Kong nightlife scene, Lan Kwai Fong is a place to be. Boasting of over 90 establishments catering to food and entertainment, Lan Kwai Fong is also known to attract local and foreign celebrities. And of course, let's not forget shopping! Hong Kong's famous Temple Street Night Market is a bargain hunter's dream. Everything from fashion, electronics, toys, and souvenirs are here. New York The Big Apple The city that never sleeps The most exciting in the world, New York, New York Filled with restaurants, bars, museums, shopping destinations and iconic sites, New York is indeed a welcoming city. A year-round destination with four seasons, New York is magical in the winter, with marvelous snowfalls and cloudless skies. In the spring and autumn, the city is at its best, with a crispness to the air and clear blue skies. The city is indeed filled with popular tourist spots. The most popular site is the Central Park, which transforms into a beautiful golden red in October. The Grand Central Terminal is known for its stunning historical feats. 
from its near destruction and restoration, the beauty of this famous Beaux Arts building is certainly a must-see. The Empire State Building, with its classic Art Deco architecture, is indeed a New York City icon. Its 102-story building is one of the most visited in the world. Visit the 86th floor outside observatory for views of up to 80 miles or 130 kilometers that are definitely worth the photos. The Lincoln Center for the Performing Arts, the world's largest performing arts center, is also home to 12 resident arts organizations, including the New York Philharmonic, Metropolitan Opera, the New York City Opera, and the New York City Ballet. Not to be missed are the world-class museums, the American Museum of Natural History, the Museum of Modern Art, and of course, the Metropolitan Museum of Art. The Times Square is yet another tourist spot to visit. In the middle of the bustling hive of activity, Times Square is known for its huge electronic billboards and many destinations for fun and activities. And finally, the reason why New York is called the city that never sleeps. The place offers endless nightlife options to choose from that makes it almost impossible to have time for sleep. There are after dark nightclubs, bars, theaters, live music, and comedy performances to explore every day, be it the weekend or a night after work. New York is also known as the restaurant capital of the world. With more than 18,000 eateries to choose from, just imagine how difficult deciding where to eat will be. The most expensive but worthy dining hangouts can be found in Midtown Manhattan, where reservations at restaurants are actually the standard. Paris, the world's most romantic city. People love it for its culture, fashion, architecture and food, and is considered the dream destination of many. The French capital has some of the most beautiful and historic buildings and monuments. The most famous of all is the Eiffel Tower, one of the most iconic constructions in the world. There's the Arc du Triomphe at the end of the Champs-Élysées. The Notre Dame Cathedral, which dates back to 1163, is the most visited attraction. Located high above the city in Montmartre is the Sacré-Cœur Basilica. And of course, the Louvre Museum, which contains the Mona Lisa and many other works of art. Don't forget the La Conciergerie. Famous as the prison, a historical landmark during the French Revolution in the 1790s. Here, you can see Marie Antoinette's prison cell, which was converted into a chapel in her memory. One can still follow the many traces of the French Revolution in this contemporary city. There's the Place de la Concorde and the Cour de Commerce, where the Marat, the extremist's extremist, published his newspaper L'Ami du Pupil. Seeped into the city's DNA is of course Paris's well-known heritage in arts and culture. Explore the cobblestone streets of Montmartre with its rich history of Belle Epoque artists and cabarets, or get a first-hand experience of the lifestyle in the neighborhood of Belleville. Get your culture fix at the Musée d'Orsay, at the newly renovated Picasso Museum, or course through the dozens of small museums and galleries you can visit in the city. Shopaholics will also delight in Paris's myriad options from chic department stores that'll have all your fashion needs ready to famed boutiques for sheer designer items. Stroll along the Champs-Élysées or watch the fashion shows. If you're traveling during the Christmas season, be sure to check out the fancy window displays. There are also places to find the best fine jewelry. You'd also want to visit any of the famous neighborhood bakeries that sell perfect Parisian bread, made using traditional French techniques. Paris also has an impressive offering of food stops. The city boasts of 70 Michelin-starred restaurants. 
you'll find one for every specialty. From fresh premium oysters to award-winning edible works of art, like the famous pastries in Paris. Bangkok. It's the city of angels and the Venice of the East. Bangkok is one of the most visited cities in Southeast Asia. Thailand's capital city brings hundreds of thousands of visitors from all over the world each year. The largest and most developed city in Thailand, Bangkok offers tourists a mix of modern and upscale sights and sounds while maintaining its old charm from its historical architecture and traditions that date back to hundreds of years. One of the most famous is Wat Arun. Located on the west bank of Chao Phraya River, opposite the Grand Palace. This is a must-see site in Bangkok, as the architectural design is completely unique to that of other temples in Thailand's capital. You can even climb its steep 70-meter high spire, which boasts the best views of Bangkok's skyline. While it is also known as the Temple of Dawn, Wat Arun is best at night when lit up as it gives off a golden beam of light over the Chao Praia River. The Grand Palace is the capital's most glorified and world-renowned structure. It was once the home of the Thai King, the royal court, and the administrative seat of government and was built back in 1782. Marvel at its ancient designs, from the diverse array of Buddhist sculptures and temples that flow through the vicinity. Most popular is the Wat Prakil, or the Temple of the Emerald Buddha. Bangkok is also well known for its busy market scene. Anchored on either side of the river are boats stocked with fresh tropical fruits and veggies, coconut juice, and local food being cooked on open grills. Also popular are the floating markets Damnon Sadwak, Ampawa, and Klong Lat Mayom. Likewise, Bangkok's mall scene is alive and kicking, with enough shops stretching from Siam along Sukhumvit Road to last a lifetime. Also within Bangkok's cosmopolitan urban jungle are the expert tailors that can be seen on almost every street. You can get a tailor-made suit together for just about a week or two at a very reasonable price. Despite the city's known busyness, Bangkok also offers experiences for rest and recluse. Massage parlors can be found all over Bangkok, offering a Thai oil massage, head, neck and back massage, foot massage, and many more. One can also opt for a nature respite from the sprawling concrete jungle nearby within the city. It is known for its lush tropical trees, lakes, and raised embankments that pass unique houses on stilts built along the Chao Praia River's edge. Auckland Auckland is known as a city of many lovers, according to its Maori name Tamaki Makura. As those lovers wanted the place so badly, that they fought over it for centuries. A geographically blessed city, the New Zealand capital has the appeal of a small town and the style of a modern metropolis. Auckland Museum is one of the country's most recognized heritage locations. The 84-year-old museum houses the most comprehensive collection of Maori and Pacific Islander art in the Southern Hemisphere. On display are graphic textiles, carvings, some of the war canoes, ware or the traditional Maori meeting houses, as well as other 18th and 19th century portraits. Devonport is a self-contained late Victorian neighborhood of historic sites, including North Head, a British fort dating back to 1887. There are also popular cafes and restaurants within it. Find two of Auckland's picture-perfect beaches or climb to the top of Mount Victoria for 360-degree views of the city, Hauraki Gulf, 
and the North Shore. Waiheke Island is a place for a quick island escape. Worth visiting are the Little Onoroa, Palm Beach, and the mile long Onitangi. Fancy a dinner nearby with a great view of the beach. A diverse mix of gustatory pleasures, Auckland is also ideal for food trips. The city is a medley of different tastes, offering diverse cuisines from contemporary Japanese dishes to all American pizzas to healthy Thai salads and greens. Depending on your mood, you can choose from the elegant dining restaurants, or you might prefer the laid back al fresco cafes. Shopping also keeps the city abuzz. Specialty stores include rare and vintage finds. From the gardening books and electric furniture, fiesta dinnerware and old photographs, as well as restored goods, such as vintage wooden cutting boards, southern French crockery, and white enamel cookware. There are also classic and one room boutiques that offer pieces for men and women, with a well curated collection of shoes and boots to match. You may also find shops featuring own brand clothes and jewelry for men and women, sold alongside a distinct merchandise mix of non clothing items that reflect the owner's interests. Berlin. For its exuberant urban life and vibrant art scene, visit Berlin. The German capital features a cultural scene and unique lifestyle that's both fast paced and relaxed. Also known as the hipster city of Europe, Berlin keeps alive with its alternative cultures and styles. In neighborhoods like Kreuzberg, Neukölln, and Frederschein, are vibrant places where locals simply chill and enjoy the relaxed open spaces and fresh air. No city in Germany is, in fact, greener than Berlin, with its forests, lakes, and sprawling parks. Berlin is also a city full of history. The World War II, after all, began and ended in the city of Berlin. Most popular, are the Brandenburg Gate and the Federal Chancellery, which are reflective of the nation's rich stories. Germany's capital is also home to its major government buildings, such as the historic Reichstag or the seat of the German parliament. Of course, most remarkable are the Berlin Wall, the East Side Gallery, and the Holocaust Memorial. Historical feats aside, Berlin is also hip and happening with its streets of bars and clubs. The city has an active nightlife that guarantees massive parties and events practically every night. But the city is friendly to non-party goers too. It has relaxed beer gardens, small bars, hostels, and art galleries to suit different tastes. Famous as a city of art, Berlin has over 170 museums, including the famous Museum Island that puts treasures of the world on public display. Tourists often visit Berlin to attend ballets and operas at the city's major opera houses, as well as witness live performances by talented orchestras such as the world-class Berlin Philharmonic. And when it comes to food, Berlin has a lot to offer too. It's a great place for vegans. It has Turkish restaurants and supermarkets everywhere, and Italian, Mexican, and Asian food spots too. Food markets offering snacks, German wine and cheese, among others, will satisfy your palate as well. The neighborhoods in Kreuzberg and Neukölln are great for finding fine restaurants and quiet lounge bars, as well as dozens of coffee bars to enjoy. When it comes to shopping, there are well-known mainstream malls to visit, alongside independent boutiques nearby that offer endless choices for your lifestyle needs. One will also find small vintage stores within Berlin, some even selling second-hand books as well as high-end designer clothing. Los Angeles, the entertainment capital of the world, Los Angeles. 
The cultural hub boasts of more than 300 museums and tourist attractions. And yes, great weather. What to do when in LA? First on the list is, of course, a behind the scenes studio tour at the Universal Studios Hollywood. The most popular attraction offers tourists a chance to explore the Hollywood movie studios, including great 3D experience shows. Next is the Walt Disney Concert Hall, found on Grand Avenue in downtown LA. It is designed by Pritzker Prize winning architect Frank Gehry, with acoustics by Yasuhisa Toyota, and has been praised by concert goers for its stunning architecture and extraordinary sound. The concert hall is home to the renowned Los Angeles Philharmonic and the Los Angeles Master Chorale. Museums and art hubs in LA are also known for housing some of the world's most renowned collection. One may find a repertoire of masterpieces, including works of Vincent van Gogh. For fans of Hollywood entertainment, movies, television and music, Los Angeles is the place where one will most likely see a celebrity. The secret is to dine at the restaurants often visited by the stars, such as the famous Wolfgang Puck at the Hotel Bel Air. LA is also a great destination for those who love to shop. Popular shopping centers and little kiosks around the neighborhood are frequently visited for great bargain finds. For the ultimate window shopping experience, visit the world-famous strip of stores along Beverly Hills, which is known as a place of luxury and style. Tired of the usual ways of discovering LA? Have a different view of Hollywood by heading to the Runyon Canyon Park, one of the most popular hiking areas in LA. One may also find quieter spots to rest and relax in LA. From Malibu to South Bay are the best beaches in Southern California. The two-mile-long Santa Monica Beach is also worth the visit, as well as the Santa Monica Pier, the Pacific Park Amusement Park, and the Heal the Bay Aquarium. A true city of champions, one should also catch a game win in LA. Visit the Dodgers Stadium, one of the great cathedrals of Major League Baseball and a popular Instagram location. The ballpark has already hosted eight World Series and the Dodgers have won four World Championships. It's time for us to go! Pack your bags and get your tickets ready. And we'll see you on the next destination. Catch us again next time on Cities of the World.